Okay, Who is Ready Summer has officially arrived in Forza Horizon 4, and I think a lot of people are going to be happy about the car rewards that we have going on here. Now, I have not looked at the Summer Forza-thon shop yet, so I have no idea what's in there. I'm hoping it's the Ferrari 812 Superfast. I just have a gut feeling I'm probably wrong, but there's a ton of great new cars in the festival playlist. So let's take a look. Is it there? Ooh, the 2019 BMW Z4 Roadster is in the Forzathon shop, as well as... What? The Subaru Blabai Impreza? What? That should not be in here, because that is a festival series reward, the season reward, whatever you want to call it. I'll show you guys in a second. I actually am very unhappy about that being in here. I have like four of them, and I can still probably sell them for $20 million a pop. But that car is finally here. Normally it was a wheel spin exclusive. And the BMW Roadster, wasn't this like a seasonal reward in the past, I believe? So two pretty nice cars sitting here. Unfortunately, I have literally everything in this Forza Thon shop. So for me, nothing huge going on here. I'm just very surprised that it's the Blah by Subi. This was, again, a wheel spin exclusive car. You can probably still sell these for a lot of money because not everyone has Forzathon points and obviously the prices are a lot higher these days. So 625 Forzathon points. For any of the new players, they're not going to be able to get these cars. But the main thing I want to take a look at here today is the new festival playlist rewards and all the new stuff going on in Series 10, Update 10, whatever you want to call it. It is here officially and the series completion bonuses for 50% we get the Bentley Continental Forza edition. I think that was in like the first week's Forzathon shop here in Forza Horizon 4. Also the Caddy Limo, I believe that's a wheel spin exclusive car. Correct me if I'm wrong on any of this stuff. There's a lot of different exclusivities for all these different cars. Now, the KTM Expo GT4, very rare car. I believe that was a Forzathon shop car. The Honda Civic 18, the Type R, so that one was in the Forzathon shop twice already, but another pretty rare car, and it's a lot of opportunities for people who can sell for $20 million to sell a lot of these rare cars to make some good money. So this week's Forzathon, the weekly challenge, it's going to fe feature the TVR Cigaris. I already started covering this before the summer season got here, so we're going to finish that up after I'm done making this particular video. We got daily challenges here, nothing too crazy. Kangaroo skills, been a while since we've seen those. The trial, that's how we're going to win the Honda NSXR 2005. I believe that is a wheel spin exclusive car. And then if we move over here, we got the Ghibli, the 14, I believe, another wheel spin car. Correct me if I'm wrong, I'm not 100% sure on that one. And then the VW Beetle, that is for sure a wheel spin car, I know that. Then if we swing over to Autumn... We got the Fiat Dino. I believe that's making a return into Forza Horizon 4. I believe that was in Forza Horizon 3. I think it's brand new in this game, though. Then the Aventador, the 2016 Aventador. I actually got this car. It's a wheel spin exclusive. Just got it off the auction house a few days ago on stream, so that was pretty cool. Then, what else do we have here as rewards? The Hummer H1. That is a wheel spin exclusive car that I don't have yet, I don't think. Another one, the Chevy Camaro, the 1979 model, another wheel spin car. So if you haven't noticed the trend yet, they pretty much said this on their update stream. A lot of the cars in this season, in this series, I should say, they're the hard-to-find wheel spin cars and some of the Forzathon shop cars. I really do expect to see the 812 come at some point over these four weeks. But there you go. There is autumn. Now, winter. What do we got here? The Hoonigan Fiesta. I believe that was a Forzathon shop car. The 1993 Fox Body Mustang, so that is a wheel spin exclusive car, another one that I personally don't have yet. Moving along here, ooh, we're going to get to drive hypercars for the weekly Forza-thon, so that should be fun. Lancia Delta, the reward for the trial in winter, I'm pretty sure I have a couple of these already. The Honda Civic, the 1984, that is a wheel spin exclusive car right there. The Audi TTRS, I didn't even realize I had this, didn't even realize it, but that is another wheel spin exclusive car. And then a brand new car for Series 10 is the AMC Rebel. Now, it's not brand new to Forza. I'm pretty sure this car was in Forza Horizon 3, but there's how you're going to get that. The AMC Rebel, you're going to have to complete the white knuckle ride. Obviously, you can't do this until winter unless you're one of those people that likes to glitch and do stupid things that risks getting you bans, which, you know... 
moving your date forward on your Xbox, whatever that stupid crap is. Don't do that, people. Just be patient. Play the game legit. No reason to risk getting banned. But the final one is spring, and there it is, the 2004 Blob Eye. So, after all this time making that car so rare, they're going to throw it in the Forzathon shop in summer, and then three weeks later in the spring season completion bonus. That, to me, is a little bit stupid, but the biggest one here, the one that I'm sure everyone's going to go crazy over, is this new hybrid monster, the Rimac C2. I'm super excited to see what this car is all about. I don't know too much about it. Never heard of it until, obviously, hearing about it coming into Forza Horizon 4, so that is certainly going to be the one that everyone's excited for, waiting for, but we're going to have to wait three weeks. Modern sports cars, that should be pretty fun to use for a weekly Forza-thon. I believe that's the 2018 Porsche Cayenne, a wheel spin exclusive car we're going to be able to win from the trial. Kind of hate how they're locking all these rarer cars behind the trial because not everyone has online, so not everyone can get these, then they have to deal with the auction house, and personally I disagree with that method, but it is what it is. Then we got the Ford Raptor, the 2011, I believe that is another wheel spin exclusive car. Tons and tons of wheel spin exclusive cars coming out through the Series 10 update in the festival playlist. Then I believe the Ferrari F50 is purchasable at the auto show, but it's probably pretty expensive. Didn't look at the price, but maybe I'll throw that up on the screen if I remember to. That is a legendary, so you're definitely going to want to get that if you can just by literally completing a season event. And that pretty much wraps it up. We obviously have the monthly rivals to do. I don't know if I even want to try online adventure again because before it was just a pain in the ass. I always got bumped out of checkpoints. Then recently when I tried it, it wouldn't let me connect. I finally got in, I was excited, I was like, let's do this, let's try something new, and then the game's like, nope, just kidding, you're not You're not playing today. So, that is what it is. That is pretty much everything that I wanted to show you guys, though. That is the update for Series 10, the entire four weeks of the festival playlist. So it started today on June 6th, 2019, and it's going to run over the next four weeks. We're obviously starting now, currently in summer, then we're going to see autumn, then we're going to see winter, and then we will finally see spring when we can get that Rimac. So that is pretty exciting. Lots of awesome rare cars here. Let me know what you guys think. Give me your opinions on all the car rewards, the challenges you have to do to get the cars, and wh what are you most excited for? There's so many things here, especially if you're somewhat newer to the game. If you haven't played since launch, there's a lot of cars here that everyone can win. Brand new ones at that. So really hope everyone enjoyed this video. Hope you found it to be helpful or useful. If you have any questions at all, please just let me know. Don't forget to drop a nice little pew 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 on that like button for me. Really appreciate the support. It does not go unnoticed and it seriously helps me out a lot. But I think I might go drive one of these rare cars or maybe a couple of them that I have out on the streets of Forza Horizon right now. So hope everyone has a fantastic week, a fantastic month if you don't watch me after this video. Hope to talk to you guys again soon. Peace. Pew, pew, pew.